Plastic pieces, unlike wood pieces, are rarely solid chunks of material, especially when they're bigger. Um, let's say I want this to be a piece of plastic. Um, it makes a lot more sense to hollow it out. There's a tool that is right back here in this toolbox, shelling out a solid. Um, basically up here it says, shell the solid, pick the solid to shell, and then it's going to ask which open faces you want to shell. And there are options here, and I'm going to show you a few. Here's one option, and it's already done, it goes fast. This might be, this is very difficult to manufacture this way, but if that's what you wanted, you got it. I'm going to undo this. You can also shell out the uh, this surface here. So here I'm going to pick this um, face of the object. Again, very difficult to manufacture, but it is completely hollow. You just can't see the inside. You can look in and it goes around the corner, but hard to make. I'm going to undo this. Most realistically, this object, if this was the top and you wanted to see this, you would make the bottom, this surface, um, you would shell that out. So I'm going to pick my shell tool. This is the object I want to shell out. Which surface do I want to shell? This surface. And that's how this looks like. From the top, it would look like normal, but from underneath, it would be hollowed out, just like a Lego piece, for instance.